Hey guys, I'm Taylor McCullough, professional wakeboarder for Centurion Boats, and today we're going to be teaching you how to hook up and launch your boat. First, we're going to slowly back up the truck to the trailer, and then we're going to drop the trailer onto the hitch. Once the trailer is on the hitch, we're going to secure the latch and pin. We're going to check and make sure that the trailer is fairly level and it's not leaning too far forward or backward. Next, we're going to hook up the electrical and the safety cables. Once you're all hooked up and plugged in, we're going to have a friend double check all the lights and make sure they're all working properly. Now that you're all hooked up, you're ready to drive and go to the boat ramp. Now that you've arrived at the boat launch, park somewhere out of the way to where you can load all your boards, coolers, and everything you may need for the day. Now that you've got everything loaded, we're going to go ahead and unhook the back straps and make sure that the plug is secured. Now that you're ready to launch, go ahead and check the ramp for any obstacles then proceed slowly down the ramp to back the boat into the water. Once the trailer tires are in the water and the boat is almost floating, you're going to put the truck in park and engage the emergency brake. You're going to walk around to the trailer and disconnect the emergency cable and the winch strap. Now you can hop back in the truck and start reversing the rest of the way into the water. The boat is going to begin to float off the trailer. Once the driver starts reversing back and the boat is clear of the trailer, you can then pull the trailer out of the water. Now that you're out of the water, go ahead and park the trailer and have an awesome day on the water. When it's time to pull the boat out of the water, we're going to back the trailer down just as we did before. Once the trailer is deep enough in the water, the driver can then begin to put the boat on the trailer. When you're approaching the trailer, it's always best to take it slow and bump the boat in and out of gear. Once the boat's close to the front, you're going to have the driver stop hook the wind strap, and then you and the driver can work together to make sure that the boat is fully loaded back onto the trailer. Go ahead and clip the safety cable, and then you can begin to pull the boat out of the water. Now that you're out of the water, you have a couple things that you need to do. You're gonna wanna take the plug out and also put the boat in trailer mode. Both of these things help remove the excess water and minimize towing weight. Before you hit the road, secure and tighten your rear trailer straps. I hope this helped you guys make this task seem a little less intimidating. I hope you guys enjoy your time on the water.